Okay. So if you was dating a ball player, if he wanted to marry you, would you take would you take a prenup? Yes. You would? Yeah. Why not? But in that prenup, I'm not leaving empty handed either. So 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 you think that he's just sending you away <laughs> with some money? He's gonna send me away with something, a house, something. No, no, see, 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 this is what I don't understand. I'd with like, a prenup, okay. you negotiate. It's a negotiation. That's all it is. I feel I feel like if, if I'm a ball player and you come marry me, I think that your life should be based on if you're with me. When you leave, you should be able to go back to where the fuck you came but from. If I'm, so you want me to just be out here after we're done and just basically be in the streets and figure out what I got to do from that point? If That's you don't selfish. have, oh, Listen, if you don't have any kids, you have to go back to where you came from. You have to go. You have to go now. One, when you in that situation, you're supposed to do something to make your own money regardless. So so you want to take from them too, right? I'm not going to take from them. I'm going to start a business. I'm going to do what I have to do to make sure I'm going to be straight regardless. Okay. All right. So if he's going to kick me out with nothing, I'm going to be okay because I have been made money on my own regardless. So you made money off his money already. I can have my own money too. Like, why can't I have? I might just not have as much as he got. Okay. So, okay. So you don't need he to not get me off the corner. Like, what the hell? Well, it, it, it's so wild because I don't understand. Like, why do y'all think when a man divorce y'all, y'all should have shit? Why? I didn't say I should have what he has. I don't expect that. But at the same time, we're together. More than like, we're, we're going to have kids. We have a whole family. Like, why would you want to send me off to basically? With not a dollar. That's selfish. We, we're done. And we're, more than likely, we're going to be done because of you. I'm okay, the listen. one going to be divorcing your ass. Okay, guess what? If we're together and we separate and I see you out like, hey, buddy, let me get a shot of that pussy. You're going to tell me, no, you can't have any of this, right? Depends because on we're how not I together, feel that right? day. Depends on what? how I feel that day. Y'all got the devil on y'all. What the <laughs> fuck is this? For real? Depends on how I feel that day. So you might still go? I might. Once you do so much to a woman, you're basically pushing her to go do something else. Okay, all right. So, okay, so have you ever been with a man that did not hurt you? No. You've never been. So that means most of them are going to do that, right? Yeah. All right, cool. So that means you're kind of used to the shit that we be doing, right? I'm used to it, but that don't mean I want to be used to it, and that don't mean I'm going to um, put up with it. Okay, so do you what, do you think it's a perfect man that exists, and he's waiting on a white horse waiting on you? No. I got to take some good with the bad. Right, okay, so right. So what what is one thing with a man that you can bend on? Is it cheating? It seems like it got to be cheating because <laughs> that's what the hell they all do. <laughs> it's like you got to have some... I mean, you got to forgive it sometime, but of course, you're not going to keep putting up with it. Okay, cool. So so why do you think men cheat so much? I don't know. That's something within y'all that y'all have to figure out. It's not my issue.